Yo, yo, what's shaking, baby? Your boy Pod the Flow, man. What's on, what's on? <laughs> Leaving Big Ridge up here, man. Just left a mansion. Lining my work up. Just got done um, doing an estimate on the driveway. And uh, we got a cold front coming in uh, starting tomorrow. And it's supposed to rain this weekend, so she told me to schedule her for next week. Get that driveway done. Then she wants me to schedule her car. Uh, the same, uh, probably the, the, the next week following. Then Edward Jones Investments, they called me yesterday. He's got three cars, but he wants to get one done once a week because he's traveling all the time. So, which is cool with me. So, uh, my wife and I just got back from uh, Hilton Head, South Carolina. I post that vacation for you guys. But uh, when her and I had a long talk about me retiring, you guys, I know, <laughs> watch out now. But it's time for your boy to step down from detailing, man. It may take me maybe two years to do it. But uh, it's time, man. I've been out here 16 years doing my thing. I have no debt. Uh, I've invested our money wisely. Uh, we don't have any worries. Uh, we're keeping God first. And... Uh, Everything seems to be working out, man. Everything is everything. You feel me? So, her and I had discussion, and uh, I'm going to slow it down this year. Uh, I probably just keep my some of my VIPs, maybe, maybe eight. Five to eight. She says she can deal with that for right now. <laughs> happy wife, happy life. <laughs> Watch out. Y'all better learn that. Man, but... <clears throat> But I, uh, you know, I'm still gonna be able to help you guys, uh, no matter what, uh, to uh, answer your questions. Had some guys call me from Florida, asking me about boats and cars and stuff like that. Uh, you guys just don't know, man. That motivates me to help you guys. As long as I know people are trying, trying to better themselves, better their lives, uh, it makes me feel good that I'm able to help them. And that's what I'm all about. You can ask anybody in my town who knows me. Say, that dude will do anything to help you. As long as you're helping yourself. <laughs> they throw that in there. He said, as long as you're helping yourself, he'll do anything to help you. So, my thing is, uh, I don't down people. I don't knock people. If I see that they're trying, you know, I give them some of my ideas. I'll be like, dude, uh, I kind of see what your problem is. I mean, this might work for you. You know, and I got a college that want me to come over there and uh, speak to some of their kids, you know, college kids over there about um, how to start their own business and entrepreneuring. So that's another route that I'm looking at taking, uh, being a motivated speaker. And um, we'll see how this college thing goes. You know, if it goes okay, I mean, it's something I might want to get into because my wife and I like traveling anyway. Uh, well, like I said, we was in the South Carolina Hilton Head last week for a week. It was my wife's birthday, so I took her to the resort to the beach. And we sat out there for a week. Next month, we'll probably be in the Bahamas. We're not just traveling just to be traveling this year. We're actually looking for our retirement spot because uh, we're not going to retire in my hometown here. Uh, I just don't feel like that because uh, my kids are grown, you know, give them somewhere to go. And I got my grandbaby, but I think she's moving back up to Nashville. So, uh, not quite sure what we what we want to be. So, we're going to do a little more traveling this year to try to lock it down to where we want to be for our retirement. Uh, I'm very excited about that. Because uh, I've invested my money wisely. Uh, my wife has been patient over the years. And kind of let me handle the finances and put our money where it's supposed to be so now it's all about preparation and you guys can still inbox me and stuff like that ask me questions you know I ain't gonna be out of the game probably for another two years <laughs> so watch out I'm still here <laughs> am I gonna sell my equipment that was my partner asked me uh, maybe some but I always like to keep some on hand just in case things don't go the way I planned so I always got my options. I always have options. 
All right, man, we're good talking to you guys again, man. As soon as this weather breaks, get out there and get your estimates so when the weather breaks, you ready. All right, be cool on the stool. Deuces.